Details tonight, nearly a dozen guns found in a man's suitcase at the Atlanta airport. And tonight he's facing charges and a Delta employee is facing suspension. This is far from the first firearm discovery in Atlanta. In 2020, 220 guns were seized at Hartsfield Jackson security checkpoints. One year earlier, during pre-pandemic travel conditions, 323 were found. CBS 46's Jamie Kennedy is live at the world's busiest airport with these shocking details. Jamie. Yeah, good evening, Rick. Crazy to think about the arsenal that man had at the airport here. That man trying to smuggle those guns through a karaoke machine, but it seems his creative methods will now have him singing the jailhouse rock. A French international man has found himself at the centre of an investigation into gun smuggling through a Hartsfield Jackson International Airport. Court documents reveal Keenan Lahome was arrested on October 11th for reportedly having nine firearms and two AR lower units concealed inside a karaoke machine that he had checked in in two bags. Lahome was bound for the island of St. Martin in the Caribbean. Experts say this is not as wild as it may seem. The, the way that guns are usually uh, traffic to Caribbean countries is through these compartments, uh, you know, in, in laundry machine, even in vehicle parts. Investigators say the guns were divided into two bags, one with the head of the karaoke machine and the other with the speaker. They then unscrewed the machines and found the firearms wrapped in aluminum foil. Lahome telling investigators this was to thwart the x-ray machine. For those looking to smuggle guns, Georgia, the experts say, is an appealing state. The flow of guns within the United States usually goes from states with, with weak gun laws, like Georgia, like Florida, to states with stronger gun laws. Delta has confirmed that one of its employees was suspended immediately in connection to the investigation. It's unclear exactly what role the employee played. Tracing exactly how many guns leave the U.S. illegally is hard to put a number on, experts say, but they do know U.S. guns travel far and wide. There are reports that show that U.S. is also an important source of crime guns in Brazil. And there was a 2018 report by Inside Crime that showed that U.S. guns were, e were even reaching Chile. Now, just this afternoon, the TSA ranked the Atlanta airport number one for guns discovered so far this year. We easily beat out Dallas with 232. Atlanta airport had 391 dis guns discovered this year. Live at Hartsfield Jackson International Airport, Jamie Kennedy, CBS 46 News. Jamie, thank you. And developing tonight.